founder and general overseer of the Synagogue Church of All Nations, Prophet T.B. Joshua, is to appear before the corona investigating the circumstances that led to the collapse of the church's building back in September 12. He will appear on November 5, 2014, along with the contractor in charge of the collapsed six-story building, which claimed no fewer than 115 lives, of course, most of them South Africans. The corona magistrate O.A. Kamala Fair, during the sitting of the court Friday, said the appearance of the church's founder was important to the findings of the court. Counsel to the church, Jude Nari, had argued that the appearance of the pastor would not be necessary as he was not an eyewitness. Komalafe, however, insisted that Joshua would have to appear. Meanwhile, a chief operational officer with the Lagos State Fire Service, Adeba Mosiliu, told the court Friday that his observation revealed that the building did not collapse as a result of an explosion. Mosiliu, who said he had, he had 34 years of experience in rescue operation, insisted that there was nothing to suggest that the accident occurred as a result of an explosion. He said all the bodies recovered were whole and not dismembered or burned. Now also, there were no scattered bricks. The floors and pillars were not shattered. Rather, the building had collapsed on top of each other. The corona sitting had been adjourned, has now been adjourned, sorry, to Tuesday.